Harris. I don't want to believe it either, but she is working for Foxhound. So you think she had a part in the uprising? Or she could be working with some different group altogether. Different group? It couldn't be. Place her under arrest. What? She's betrayed us. She needs to be arrested and interrogated to find out who she's with. If she's one of their spies, then we're in big trouble. Damn what do you right, mean? Man. Oh, nothing. Have you let her in on some kind of vital secret or something? Does this have anything to do with the mysterious deaths of the DARPA chief and the arms tech president? I... I have no idea. Maybe. Anyway, we cannot allow her to participate any further in this mission. Wait, wait a minute. Without her, we can't complete this mission. I knew it. You're hiding something. Give me some time. I'll try to get it out of her. Hurry then. We've got to figure out who she is and what she's doing here. I understand. Snake, give me some time. I don't have any time left for you. Ooh, you betray Snake, you get fucked. Okay, so... We are going to Metal Gear's place. It's crib. Okay, um, a lot of motherfucking cameras up in here. So, <clears throat> look, see, you can take them out or you can just you know, chaff it up. But I'd rather chaff it because, you know, they just respawn every time they come through here anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, we be pooping. We be pooping. Bam, hoo hoo Look, hey, Metal Gear got a penis. He got a penis. Look, Metal Gear's got a little penis. Aww, so small. But yet so deadly. <laughs> yeah, anyway. Okay, here, let's go. <clears throat> I think this is the part where you have to get Palky. I can't remember. What's up? Oh, Otacon, okay. Snake, it's me. What's wrong? Did you find a good place to hide? Yeah, thanks, thanks to the stealth gear. It looks like they've finished getting Metal Gear ready. How do you know that? I overheard them talking. Where are you now? Right in front of Metal Gear, but it's strange. What is? There's nobody here. No guards, nobody patrolling. It's too quiet. Maybe because they're all ready. They said they even input the PAL codes. What should I do? All we can do Run is use the override out. system that President Baker told you about. But I've only got one of the three keys. And besides that, like Ocelot said, there's some trick to using the keys. Leave it to me. You got some kind of plan? Well, I'm in the computer room right now. I'm trying to access Baker's private files. Baker's files? Don't you need a password? Of course, but there are ways. Are you a hacker? Yep. That describes me pretty Fucking well. Nerd. Does it look like you can get in? You're I don't nerd. know yet. I'll give it a try. Got the spec. I'm counting on you. The hood. The hair. Fucking nerd. So, the fate of the world. Uh, uh, the fate of the world. Better. Fucking English accents coming through. It's really sad. Is in the hands of a fucking hippie. Well. You know, Duke Mark of Woodstock, so it ain't gonna work now. Snake, it's me again. How's it going? Uh, not bad. I just got past his third security level. He was a pretty careful guy. Do you think you'll break in soon? I never met a system I couldn't bust into. Okay, keep trying. Okay. We'll be digging, digging. Digging that ass, we be dig, 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 dig in that ass. Oh, I don't know. Okay, four foot ladder, we're going up, up, up. Moving on up to the big city. What do you want now? Oh, motherfucker. Snake, <clears throat> I did it. You got Finally. past security? Bingo. Great. So, what do you got? I accessed the confidential Metal Gear file. 
So what about the PAL override system that Baker talked about? I haven't found it yet. What? That's what I need to know. But Snake, I found something else. What? The secret behind the new nuclear weapon. Just as I thought, the nuclear warhead is designed to be fired from the railgun like a projectile. It doesn't use fuel, so it isn't considered a missile. That way it can get around all sorts of international treaties. Pretty sneaky. Yes, but effective. And that's not even the scariest thing about this weapon. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. It's a stealth weapon. You mean it won't show up on radar? Sneak upon yeah. you and kick your ass? The truth ass. is, they've been working on a stealth missile Shit. since the late 70s. Why weren't they able to develop one until now? Because of the missile rocket propulsion system, it would be picked up by enemy satellites. Oh yeah, that makes sense. But unlike a missile, the railgun doesn't burn any propellant, so it can't be detected by any current ballistic missile detection systems. An invisible nuclear warhead. Totally impossible to intercept. And on top of that, it's got a surface-piercing warhead designed to penetrate hardened underground bases. Penetrate. We learned that lesson in the Gulf War. This thing could mean the end of the world. It's the ultimate weapon. And from a political point of view, it avoids the problem of nuclear reduction and nuclear inspections. Colonel, is this true? Are you listening? I'm listening. If word of this got out, it could delay the signing of the START III treaty and cause a huge international incident. Yeah, it would be nasty. The United States would be denounced by the UN. It could even bring the president down. Did you know this, Colonel? I'm sorry. You've changed, Colonel. You changed, I won't make man. any excuses. Snake, listen to me. This new nuclear weapon, it's never actually been tested, only simulated. You mean they ran a computer model? Yeah, that's why they were conducting this exercise. They needed to get actual experimental data to back up the simulation. What were the results of the exercise? It looks like it went better than they hoped for, but I can't find the data anywhere on this network. You'd think the data as important as that would be carefully recorded. It was. President Baker gave me an optical disk with all of the test data. What? Do you still have it? On you. No. Ocelot took it from me. Oh shit, yeah. yeah. Sorry. The terrorists have replaced the dummy warhead with a real warhead. Once they input the detonation codes, they should be ready to launch. So you think they can do it? Well, the dummy warhead was designed to be identical to the real thing, so I think so. Did you find out how to override it yet? Not yet. It must be in a separate file. Right now I'm looking through all of Baker's personal files. We're counting on you. Finally, okay, you look over here and you see Dickwood and also bitch. See, Dickwood and also bitch because I hate that motherfucker. Also bitch because, well, he a bitch. So. Dickwood because he's a dick. Simple as. Okay, um, there's always a guard here. Always, always, always. Look, see, he's over there. Wait, well, just walked over there. <clears throat> hopefully, well, not hopefully, but they'll probably catch me on the way back. So let's hope he doesn't. Where the f he a ghost? He go poof. Wait, no, there he is. I'm gonna poof your ass. I got PSG one ammo. Yep. Okay. Yes, fuck you. Fuck your ass. Up. Come on. Around the corner. Come around the corner. Boom! In your throat. You got dampled. You got splooshed. Oh yeah, that's my word. Yeah. Splooshed. Yeah, splooshed. The fuck do you want now? Snake. What? Did you find it? No. Oh, for I haven't fuck, found man. out about the override system yet. But I found Baker's ulterior motive. Here we go. He's just looking to get rich, isn't he? Well, that's part of it. Arms Tech is in much worse financial trouble than I thought. I know they lost their bid to make the next generation fighter jet. That plus the reduction in SDI spending. It looks like there was even some talk of a hostile takeover. Everything was riding on this project, I guess. And it looks like we were paying a lot of bribe money to the DARPA chief. Bribe money, huh? Yeah, and Baker was a big proponent of the nuclear deterrent theory. I see. So anyway, what about the override? Just give me a little bit longer. Man, any more 